Hello everyone, my name is Grant Shipley and I'm a senior director at VMware focused on Kubernetes. As I'm down in my basement recording this short little keynote presentation, my kids are upstairs doing what most kids are doing today, and that's online learning. And that's what I'm here to talk to you about today. But let's start with the numbers. Now, five years ago was the first ever KubeCon, and I was fortunate enough to be able to attend. And during that conference, we had 500 att attendees. Let's fast forward to 2020 to this specific event, and we have over 25,000 people registered and attending KubeCon this year. We have been moving extremely fast during the last five years. Kubernetes has been adopted as the default platform for cloud native applications going forward. And if you believe some of the numbers and analysts, this was according to the IDC Futurescape survey, 500 million new applications will be developed over the next five years. That is more than the last 40 years combined. Now, the challenge with that though, is that according to Stack Overflow's recent uh, state of development survey, 42% of all developers have less than five years of experience. And so we need to be able to ensure that we are embracing these new people into the community as they come up to speed on Kubernetes and that we have the tools and knowledge to be successful. Now at VMware, we have a lot of Kubernetes, and this is a topic that's been on the top of our mind for the last year or two. How do we create online learning experiences to bring new people into the Kubernetes ecosystem? We've been working on a soon to be open source project that will allow us to create and deliver interactive training. We'll have more on that later. However, at this time, I want to turn it over to Marissa, who's going to update you on some of the work that we have going on right now at VMware. Thanks, Grant. On the topic of making online learning better, I want to highlight Cube Academy. Cube Academy offers free online Kubernetes training. Anyone can go to kubeacademy.com to take courses designed and delivered by experts. The course library is always expanding, but right now we have 20 courses and more hours of training than the entire series of Schitt's Creek. <laughs> to give you a taste for the courses, here's a great starting point for beginners. If you're new to Kubernetes, we recommend taking these three courses in order to help build your foundational knowledge. For those of you with a more intermediate skill level, we have courses that will help get you ready for the CKA exam, a course that will walk you through options to get observability into your applications and systems, a course that dives into Kubernetes object types, and many more. We even have courses for experts too. You can dive into the world of networking to understand the Kubernetes network model, learn the design principles and components of the Kubernetes machine, and get hands-on with command line operations for kubectl. You can even sign up for Cube Academy Pro for free to get, interact to get access to interactive workshops and more in-depth content. These courses are led by the same individuals that are contributing to Kubernetes and related open source projects. They're sharing what they've learned from hundreds of Kubernetes deployments. And of course, they're creating these trainings for you, so they're always curious to hear which topics you would like them to cover next. If you're looking to contribute your own knowledge, you can join the faculty. Use this QR code to access an application form to become a Cube Academy instructor. So if you're looking to advance your knowledge of Kubernetes, you can go to kubeacademy.com today to start your first course. This community continues to lift each other up and sharing our knowledge is part of how we drive Kubernetes and the cloud native ecosystem forward. And with that, thank you so much and enjoy the rest of KubeCon.